Hey guys, once again I'm going to be playing for Extra Life this year. Um, before we go on to why I'm playing for Extra Life, let me just give a really big thanks to um, our donors from last year, Noni, Dan and Kate, um, David and Kendra. I just want to say thank you so much. Um, as you know, I play for Johns Hopkins Children's Center and this money makes so much of a difference to so many kids. Um, my particular story is uh, my oldest daughter, uh, when she was first born, she had to have a surgery right there at Johns Hopkins, and then a couple years later she had another surgery, and both times saved her life. So any amount that you can donate really means so much to me. Thank you so much for watching this, and I hope you enjoy whatever I'm just about to play. Bye. It's time for every play of Stardew Valley, Game 1, Episode 1. Hey guys, how's it going? Just gonna start up a game of Stardew Valley. So, um, story behind that. Uh, I used to love playing Harvest Moon um, back when I was in college. And uh, when Stardew Valley came out and everyone was talking about uh, the giant bomb cast and stuff like that, I said, yeah, that sounds like a game I'd like to play. Um, but, you know, not having a lot of time to play, I just never bought it. Recently, my brother um, Dave wanted me to play with him multiplayer because that's something they added in the last year or so. And I've never played before, so I figured I should probably know what I'm doing before I play multiplayer. Um, so I installed it um, in the living room uh, on Fedora, and it works perfectly fine on Fedora with the installer that saves for Ubuntu. Um, and So far, my seven-year-old really likes it. So, I'm gonna play for about half an hour. Let's get started. All right, so here's my dude. And uh, just gonna lower the game music a little bit just to make sure. All right, so it's a boy, uh, Eric. Uh, farm will be uh, Eagle Farm, favorite thing. Say camera, dog person. That eye color is fine, hair color is fine. I'm gonna go with Chrono Trigger here. A little skull shirt, why not? And a beard, why not? I'm just gonna do standard farm, just since it's my first playthrough. All right, here we go. <coughs> and for my very special grandson, I want you to have the sealed envelope. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before growing up Dennis. Pretty dark for this game, man. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Now let Grandpa rest. Your grandpa who looks like uh, Santa Claus. 20 years later, or maybe just XX later, Joja. Join us. Thrive. Work rest. I like the people watching over the cubicle farm. So the first time that we went through this, huh, there's a Mario guy that <laughs> terminated. What was funny is one of the kids noticed that the guy on the left is licking his lips. 
but Sam, my young, my boy, noticed all the way on the right there's a skeleton. I didn't even notice that. That's pretty funny. Oh, and there's security cameras watching everybody. I didn't notice that the first time either. <coughs> the old letter. If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly... Here I ever close the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Eagle Farm, is located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. Is the perfect place to start your life. This is my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family. Name my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? I like the corporation thing. It's like this unique, modern touch to, you know, Harvest Moon's just like, hey, you're gonna take over your grandpa's farm but this one's like no you're working a cubicle farm you're like f that let's go work in a farm <coughs> it's funny scarlet's not used to cutscenes. So on like day five or something, there's a cutscene. She's like, why can't I move around? Hello, you must be Eric. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mary Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's right there right now, tidying things for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you follow me. What a messy overgrown farm. This is an eagle farm. Ah! That's very crow and trigger, so I have the right here for that. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. A little dedication, you have to clean up in no time. And here we are, your new home. Ah, the new farmer. Hey, Gramp says hi. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone you moves in. It's quite a big deal. A lot of wood I got up here. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Rude. That's pretty funny. Don't listen to her, Eric. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied, so you buy one of her house upgrades. Hmm. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you gotta explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come to collect it during the night. See, I think he should have stood over here, because it makes it seem like he should be putting stuff in the mailbox. Well, good luck. So move is Wazda, walk is shift, check things with the right, mouse, okay. Um, oh yeah, uh, one thing they said is make sure to do this. There we go. All right. I got some parsnip seeds and a new journal entry. Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use the seed pack and the till soil to sow a crop. Water every day till the crop is ready. Introductions. Alright, so I should meet two of 28 people. Alright, see what's on the TV. Weather. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. I don't think it rains right away. Shout out from the future. Good humor, a little extra luck today. That's good. I think you're supposed to do, whoops, supposed to do like picking of your plants or something on a luck day. Chop wood and search for wild forage to earn some cash while waiting for your first harvest. Okay. I wonder if I would enjoy this more with the game controller. 
Alright, I think I'm going to do my first little patch of land right here. Alright. Got some stone. Uh, some... Alright, let's get the... No, that's not the hoe, is it? What's the... There's the hoe. Alright. Nope, don't want to waste that energy. Hey, that's not what it was pointing, but okay. What have I got here? Two by one, two, three, four. So that's eight. All right, let's uh, get some seeds going here. Well, this part's definitely easier with a mouse and keyboard than with the controller. All right, three more to go. All right, watering time. <laughs> I like how he kind of like stands on his tiptoes. That's pretty cute. I didn't notice that on the big screen, but that might be because I was a little sitting a little further away, maybe. So I read somewhere not to cut too much grass in the beginning because you want to be able to put in the silo when it turns to hay. And also that you want to get a greenhouse before too long. Alright, Vincent's birthday, Pam's birthday, Pierre's birthday, lots of birthdays. Which is the time to, uh, oops, don't want to do that. Hey, you. Hey, you. Oh, nothing posted today. No. Yeah, Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. Hey, Marnie. Can we talk again? Livestock and animal care products. You just swing by sometime. All right, so Marnie sells animal stuff. Pierre's got good stuff. All right. Oh, some birds flew away. Alex. Huh, he's got a football. That's cool. Oops. That's not what I want to do, is it? Just wasting water. Speaking of which. There we go. Nope, it's not home. That's Lewis's house. Beach house and some shells. It's locked. Elliot, Elliot's house. Okay. And this requires how much wood? Three hundred wood. It's supposed to be some good stuff like sea urchin or something you can get over there, according to a guide that I read. So I have to keep that in mind. Wonder if I can buy fishing supplies here. Scarlet hasn't been here yet, so. I'll be back tomorrow, gone fishing, huh? Cute. F. So I've got five people. Another person to meet. Do you want something? So I noticed most people will talk to you twice and then not talk again, at least for that day. Do, do, do. I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. 
So who is that that works at the saloon? What's her name? No, oh, I'll figure it out later. Blue-haired lady works at the saloon. Oh, this dude's into music. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Don't talk to strangers. Most of the strangers, but you seem okay. Sure, Vincent, sure. Not exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Jody trying to find a new dad for her kids? <coughs> Alright, so here's the livestock store, I think. Potentially. Not that I have anywhere to put them just yet. Oh yeah, I do like that you can't go into anyone's room if you're not friends with them, which makes sense. It's locked. I like the music, it's good music. Oh, there she comes. Oh, nothing to say to me. Wood, wood, wood. Chop. Judo chop. Judo chop. Hey, lady. Too involved with the camera. That's okay. I can understand that. Do, 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 do. Cinder Sap Forest, Pelican Town. <laughs> it's already the afternoon. Look at that. There's a store around here I'm looking for. Maybe it's over here. Oh, an old lady. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, Evelyn. You can call me Granny if you like. I don't like, but okay. The saloon. <laughs> Dog. I can buy spaghetti and omelette recipes and stuff, all right? Uh, all that stuff is like all my money, so I'm not gonna do that just yet. I'm a newcomer, it says. Huh, <laughs> Penny Single. Lex Single, Emily Single. Emily Single. Many, many other people. All right. I think I've Kind of got the hang of this if I play with Dave. Pierre's. I feel like there's another store missing. Maybe not. But. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. From regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents. It's just rewarding work. Sure it is. Alright. Let's go chop some wood. Okay, so shift is to go slowly. <laughs> Not strong enough to break a stump. Alright, well, crappy axe. This is a crappy axe. I don't know of any reason to not do all my stone right now. to catch it. Oh yeah, I should put the shell in there so I have some more money. I do that when my energy runs out and I go to bed for the day. Sure, what that is, but okay. Alright, just clearing up my land. Oh, there's a cave back here. Look at that. That's cool. I didn't notice that when Scarlet was playing. I wonder if she's noticed it yet. Huh. 
Uh, it's probably overkill. to plant mushrooms. What's this place? Whatever this once was, it's now in ruins. Well, then. Something kind of nice about this. Do, 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 do. No bad guys, just breaking stuff on your fire. Oh, I got some coal. Alright, it's 7 o'clock and I'm almost out of energy. Alright, let's go put some shells in there. Well, I'm definitely going to increase my skills at breaking stone pretty soon. Do, 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 do. My bed can't move. Huh. Yes. And there's day one. 50 G's. Day two. <coughs> Probably play till this day's done and that's it. Willie's got something for me. greenhouse other than that I'm not sure so I gotta find the girl that does upgrades Ahoy there, son. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. I'm still trying to unwind from a month of, out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. He's probably going to give me his old one. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important for me that the artificial stay alive. Hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Ta-da! Bamboo pool. There's good water here in the valley, all kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come back and eat supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. Hehe, <laughs> that's what my old used to say anyways.
wait, wait, let me see something here. Oh, no, nothing to go for there. Alright. It's locked. Nine to five. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Okay. There's not really any instructions here on what I should be doing. Oh, I guess I click on it. Alright, well, anyway. Let's see. Map. Blacksmith. I got a pretty big farm. Carpenter shop, that's what I want to go up to the top. Lines, nothing, nothing. Okay, all right, let's go talk to her, see what I need to do for that goal. Oh, first, let's see if there's any shells. No shells. I'm going to fix up here. I need 300 wood. I've got 24. Here's a shell. Oops. Right. Oh, I thought maybe that was some wood. center. It's locked. Let's see. Map. Alright, so they want to go to the right and up. Have you met everyone in yet? That sounds exhausting. set up here. What the carpenter need with microscopes? Maru. I wonder if that's Maru. Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Saying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter Maru? She's interested to meet you. I have not, unfortunately. Oh, there she is. Sebastian. Oh, no, that's Sebastian, not Maru. Alright, so I came all the way up here, but... Nothing. Alright, let's go back to my farm. Get some more wood. Oh yeah, that's a telescope. I was wondering what the heck that was. Birds. some more seats too, it appears, maybe tomorrow. A squirrel, that was a big squirrel, like a cat-sized squirrel.
Productions, Crafting. So we make a sign. Sign, path, path. That's just for making stuff pretty. Gate. for now. that is oh, lots of stones so much work for my dude here I am supposed to figure out or do something with scarecrows because I'll start eating my stuff. Scarlet already had some scarecrows take her stuff. One of her parsnips. I mean, sorry, scarecrows had bird tickets. You could use the scarecrow. I was not thinking there. Then again, I did go to bed a little late last night. Danger of passing out, better get. Do, do, do. Let's go to one more thing. There we go. to sell my clam. Ooh, pickaxe proficiency. New crafting recipe. Cherry bomb. Nice. Not sure what that's useful for, but okay. Spring weeds have caused damage to your farm. What? Sounds like it's raining. Tomorrow is beautiful and sunny. But today, I think it's a rainy day. Alright, well, anyway. Let's leave that at that. just yet. Campfire. Cherry bomb. Copper ore and core. Huh. Stand back. That's funny. Alright. I think that's it for today. We'll exit to desktop. Alright. So this has been Eric playing uh, some Stardew Valley. Enjoying it. And uh, we will uh, see you next time. Bye.